Autumn Blast promo was here. We're getting it on Monday and we're gonna get a bunch of good stuff. Find out more on how you can get all these cards added to your team. What's good, everybody? What's going on? It's your boy Rob, aka Roboto. Now, look, Autumn Blast is coming. It's been confirmed. EA said so. We are getting the promo on Monday, so you're going to be able to log in and get stuff started. But we have some interesting parts about this promo. Going to dive into that in a little bit. But before we get into that, just want to let you know if you are new here, appreciate you for stopping by. You can hit subscribe and the notification bell right down below. There's a video here. Subscribe to the channel. Get notified anytime I'm live. You can also smash, just, just destroy the like button. 30 likes, 30 thumbs up. We're gonna open an Autumn Blast bundle because we got some hot packs. It looks like some awesome packs coming. Also too, let me know down below, which one of these players are you gonna add to your team? There's a bunch of solid options. Gonna go over all of them that are coming out in part one. We got part two coming later in the week. And one more thing before we get started, if you see this little guy below, see this little Gohan below me? He's gonna say hi to everybody. See him say hi. We got the special addition to the stream. So if you are on Twitch, if you wanna make an account, if you got a Twitch Prime sub, hell, even if you wanna come by and just leave the stream open and hang out. So go check it out right along here. The second one down is the Twitch, um, Instagram, Twitter, all that good stuff. Those are all my feeds. That's the best ways you can find me. We'll also have a link to the Discord below too, where you can hit me up, ask me questions, join the server, join the community, and you two can join. We got a bunch of people already chilling in the Twitch channel. We wanna see you. I wanna see your face there. So come by, say hello. Let me know you're coming from YouTube. Come show your love. Um, you can also get a Sprite. You can hang out with all the people. So shouts to everybody who's chilling with me today on Sunday. We made some team of the week picks. I reviewed some teams. I gave some suggestions. Had a great time on stream. So shouts to you guys. Flames, Ray Dog, um, DK, Martin. I, all you guys appreciate y'all for stopping by. Um, Snyder, you already know who you are. Cody, all you guys appreciate y'all for stopping by. I want to hear from more of you though. And one last thing, Wednesday night, we're going to be live streaming the NBA draft. Going to watch along, going to give reactions, thoughts, all that good stuff. So if you want to kick it with me there we're gonna do that wednesday we're also gonna have a giveaway for reaching 500 followers on twitch so we're gonna give away some gift cards we're gonna have a good time over there wednesday night nba draft all right so swing by we're gonna have the new xbox we're gonna be playing 2k i know it's a madden channel but we're gonna have some fun all right so wednesday night let's have a good time and maybe we'll get into auto blast too but let's jump right into it let's see what we got so for purposes of properly explaining this, I'm just going to play the Good Morning Madden or the special Sunday night Madden stream along the video. And I'm going to react in real time to what we got going on here. So first things first here, we got the golds and the low golds. Um, don't overreact right away. Like these are just the low golds we need for the sets as we get for everything. Um, it's funny to note here too, if you look above my head right here, it still has the redux thing. So you see how much EA really paid attention to that. Um, <laughs> But here's some of the higher golds right here is 86 Trey Boston and some of these guys, you know, they're not going to be added to your team if you don't have a need for them, right? 86 for me, I got a 92. I'm, I'm cool on that. But some of them, you know, theme teams, you'll be able to add them and, and get them on the squad. So Corey Davis here, 88 speed. Um, that's really all you note about Corey Davis, 88 speed on the 86. Then up next is Leonard Williams, 71 speed. These are just the lower overalls, right? Power move 87, finesse move 70. You're not really doing much. He's going to go on my team, obviously. Giants team team I need to continue to build that up. So Leonard Williams will be there. Alejandro Villanueva will be added as well. 82 strength. Not really doing much there with the 87, so Steelers theme teams will be added. These are going to be good for the currency, right? Um, here's Joe Sherbert. I know I went over the other day in my LTD predictions. I had him on, on the list. Obviously, he probably won't get an LTD now because he just got an upgrade. So um, it's not, it's a linebacker. Who cares? Um, here's the highlight, I would say, out of all of these is Sherman. It's a fullback. You know, we all need fullbacks to fill the squad. So these are some of the players that are coming out. Here's the master, Tony Romo. Let's stop it right here. We're going to stop throughout this every now and then. Let's go over Romo. 78 speed, 92 throw power. Um, the accuracy is 94. Mid is 92. Short is 94. He's an improviser archetype. It's not a horrible card. It's just slow. Um, so, I mean, it depends like what you like to play, your, your, your abilities on them, how you like to run your offense. So it's not a bad card at all. It's just, it's just slow, right? 92 throw power though isn't, isn't half bad. So we're almost getting an upgrade. He's going to be the master for this program. There's going to be other cards that we are going to go over that are 91, 92 overalls. Um, you can boost them up to a 93 in some cases. We'll go over all that as we progress in through the program here. So here's the alternate currency, fallen leaves, not just leaves, they've fallen. Watch out. They have hit the ground. 
Um, you're gonna get the red zone or the red zone. You're gonna get the autumn blast welcome pack. It's gonna have Romo. It's gonna have the little guidelines for the event. Uh, same standard stuff here. Um, but it's important to note that Romo does quick sell for the alternate currency. So once this pops up, I'll show you guys right next to my head. So you can see right here, fallen leaves, quick sell. So what that tells me is that all these cards that are in this promo, similar to most feared, um, are gonna sell for some sort of alternate currency. Now here's the solos. So follow along if you will. First off of the Autumn Blast solos, and in these solos, you have the opportunity to get a card, upgrade it all the way through, and then keep keep a card. I mean, it sounds very simple, but yeah, that's it really. But you gotta do it through the solos. So on these Burnt Turkey missions, um, you gotta go through to the main missions and click the Burnt, burnt Turkey stuff. <laughs> At least it's not, you know, take this corridor down this street, around the corner, up the block, stick it up your butt, right? So the Burnt Turkey solos, um, you only have a time, they have a time limit on them. You get an autumn all-star player. Um, the time limit is 10 a.m. 1126. So 1126 is when that expires. So get on that as soon as you can. I suggest that you earn a 91 overall autumn all-star. Um, you can earn fallen leaves through all this too. This is just basically what they're going over in the missions. It's nothing too, too crazy. Here are some of the autumn all-stars. I know you see some faces to Sean Watson, Hollywood Brown, um, Jalen Smith. We'll go over all of them later on. This is just how they show them in the, in the, uh, in the special stream. Here's the Autumn Odyssey part of it, where you get the different, I forget what these guys are called, Autumn Aces, excuse me. Um, you can get, you get them at an 80, you get collectibles through the solos, and they get up to a 92 overall. Four names there, we'll go over them in detail, obviously, with all the cards. Um, not too bad cards, it's a nine, it's an 80 at first, you get the 80, you put the stuff in it, you get the collectibles through the solo, and then you level up from there. Now, the key with Tony Romer here is you exchange four Autumn Aces into the set and you get Romo, right? If you want Romo, that's how you do it. If you don't want Romo, I mean, I don't know what to tell you, but you can keep all the 92s you want, right? All the Autumn Aces. Um, so for the Autumn Odyssey, you earn the 80, and basically you're doing a cross-country road trip and you're getting collectibles to upgrade that 80 that you select at first, okay? Now, don't be too alarmed. There's gonna be ways that you can get these cards. Um, it's not just through solos, you can buy packs, all that good stuff. Um, and the milestones, you're gonna get leaves as you progress through, okay? And the leaves are gonna be important. It's the alternate currency. It doesn't look like we have a training reroll, but there are packs, okay? Um, now, what you do here is you pick one of these four guys. And I'll tell you which ones I recommend to pick as soon as we get to, up to that point. But uh, right here, basically the challenges are you go through, play the challenges, and as you can see there, there's an upgradable ace fantasy pack. That's just one of the collectibles that you get. You get the pack and then you progress through and you get other stuff. I don't know what exactly it is. Um, he didn't show us, they didn't show us in that in the special stream, but he said that there's parts that you gotta put in to upgrade it. Um, so once you get the card, as you can see right here, Alan Robertson, Brandon Sheriff, Fletcher Cox, and Pat Pete over there all the way to the right. Once you get the card, it's gonna be 80 stock um, right there for you. Basically, the power progression is gonna be very similar as if you put in his power path, which I found to be a little interesting. Um, so you're basically gonna get all the items that you get through the solos, okay? So you add any food collectible to upgrade ratings and unlock the scheme chemistry slides you see right there in the middle. So um, you just basically take the items, throw them all in, and then you're gonna get the 92 at the end of it. Um, as you can see here is Pat Pete. That's the last part of it. And you get all the way powered up through to that card. And then what you can do after that is take that card and put it in his power path. So it's important to remember, I think Pat Pete's the number one option here, in my opinion. Um, but right here is something interesting that I noted. Um, you know, you get the cranberry sauce by playing the solos, who cares? But who is this dude? Who is this random blonde bearded man wearing a Green Bay Packers shirt? Is it Clay Matthews? I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Somebody in my Twitch chat earlier suggested AJ Hawk. So I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. We'll see though, we'll see though. The last time I thought somebody was something in a EA loading screen, it turned out to be me just playing myself. So we won't look too much into it, but it is, you know, Green Bay Packers logo, Blondie. There's another part to the promo, who knows? So here are the four players that you get through the uh, the 92 overalls. These are the guys that are gonna go into Romo's set. So here's Fletcher Cox, number one, Fletcher Cox here, DT. Not too bad, not too bad. Brandon Sheriff here, 88 strength, but the run block is where he shines there to 92 overall. Not too bad for the Washington football team. That's a solid right guard right there. Next up is Allen Robinson. He's probably the worst card out of all these high level cards. Um, Carlo said like, don't worry about the speed. It's gonna be good on the Bears team team, but not everybody has a Bears team team. Everybody has a regular team team. So uh, 88 speed, 87 deep route running is not gonna cut it, unfortunately. I guess he's tall, right? He's like 6'2 or whatever. 
um, 6'5", whatever it is. But Patrick Peterson obviously looks like the lock here. 91 speed, 92 man, 90 zone, 88 press can go up to 90 if you got the right chem zone. It play rack is solid, jumps into 92. It's a pretty damn good card. So I'll probably be getting him on the team. So as you go through here, you see Burnt Turkey once again. Uh, obviously, you get the milestones are the fallen leaves. So the Burnt Turkey, as you see right here, the featured tier, 70 stars. You get a 91 Autumn All-Star. So that's very important to note. The Autumn All-Stars are different from the guys that go into the Tony Romo set. The Autumn All-Stars are basically going to be the guys who are playing on Thanksgiving Day, I believe. I believe that's what they're doing here. Um, they're going to give us all these guys that they hit certain milestones and they'll be able to boost their OVRs. And we'll show you that in a moment here. But as you can see, all the milestone rewards, we're basically getting more leaves. And right there, Tier 7, 91 overall Autumn All-Star. Are there more tiers below that? It looks like it. Um, are we going to get another additional player as we play and progress through on Friday? Who knows? But right there at Tier 12, you get 200 leaves. And at Tier 11, you get 200 leaves as well. So it might not be a bad idea to plow through the solos here. So... The solos aren't that intricate, I guess. Uh, the perfect day. You go in here and you just got to get all these requirements done. It's 25 yards to drive, rush for 15 plus yards as a bonus. I mean, this is brainless, easy, easy, easy work. There's no reason why you guys shouldn't have any of these guys on your team. But here are the Autumn All-Stars. Kicking it off for us is going to be Eric Ebron, who's actually not that bad. 87 speed, 88 short route running 87 medium route running they for some reason took out deep route running and put running block run blocking in there when he's a 68 run block like who cares like give us the relevant stats for him you guys know what they are um so yeah it's not too bad it's not a bad card Steelers steam teams um i don't think he has a power up so i don't know if he'll be able to get like lions cam um so that would kind of suck if he doesn't get a power up now or sometime through the year but he's an autumn all-star basically for this card if you achieve any of the milestones on their card right four receptions seven plus receiving yards he gets a plus one for each one he does so if he gets four receptions he's getting a plus one same thing here with jalen smith if he gets eight tackles plus one one plus sack plus one so you can get up to 93 uh 87 overall 92 hit power 86 zone 90 play rec uh 77 block shed 89 tackle so he's more of a coverage linebacker pass coverage linebacker he's a little speedster there kendall fuller here a free safety one pass defended one interception um 91 speed 90 zone 92 man so that's going to be a solid, solid card there. Washington football team really coming up in this promo too, by the way. Uh, two solid cards here. Deshaun Watson on Thanksgiving Day. 275 plus passing yards, four total TDs. 86 speed, 91 throw power. Uh, deep accuracy is 86, so it's not the best. He's also an improviser. Interesting that we're getting two improvisers. And Watson was also a pick for me for an upgrade um, for limited. Uh, Desmond True Font, 90 speed, 86 man, 90 zone, but three total tackles plus uh, one plus interceptions and he's getting a boost to his OVR as well and Marquise Brown probably the best card of the bunch in this whole promo 93 speed 90 deep route running 89 catch 88 spec catch and 87 catch in traffic doesn't have a power up but just 60 receiving yards and one touchdown you can be a 93 I wonder if that also boosts the speed but nonetheless 93 speed that's that's a, that's up there right that's up there with ter scary Terry so that's a pretty damn good card he's probably the best one we're getting out of this autumn all-stars bunch um, I really like this card a whole lot. So it might be an interesting add to the squad, especially for the Ravens theme teams. So here are the sets for Autumn Blast. Now it's very important to remember, this is how you get uh, six Granny's recipes from the Autumn Odyssey challenges, turn them into a random Nat Autumn Blast player. Really get lucky, you could earn the auctionable 92 Autumn Ace expires at 10 a.m. on 11.30. So for here, you gotta get the collectibles. Granny's recipe and Autumn Odyssey and then you get the Nat Autumn Blast player, right? Um, so just keep that in mind. You're gonna have to get these. It looks like a recipe. There's turkey, there's giblets, there's cranberry sauce, there's all this annoying shit. Who cares? Um, Tony Romo. Now, here you go. You gotta exchange Allen Robinson, Brandon Sheriff, Patrick Peterson, and Fletcher Cox to get Romo, but not only do you get Romo, you get all four back as Nat. Now, I don't know if it's half training or quarter training. Very good question. We might find out tomorrow on the GMM stream when they do it again. But nonetheless, we're getting all four back. So um, all three of them are really solid. Alan Robinson, I mean, whatever, it's training. But at the end of the day, I'll probably keep uh, Patrick Peterson at the very least. Maybe Fletch. Uh, probably get rid of Fuller and Robinson. But we'll see. We'll see how the, how the cookies crumble when it gets to that point. I might have Fuller on the team as a backup, get rid of Marcus May. Who knows? But overall, that's solid for the sets. Um, right here is the store. So special offer. You got a dollar fifty eighty five plus Autumn Blast player. Um, if we stop right here too, there's a Rivals token in there for some reason. Let's rewind that back a little bit. There's a Rivals token here. I don't know why. So that's interesting to note. 
um and then right here are the autumn blast offers now they're all are for the uh the, the leaves right so you're gonna get an autumn aces fantasy pack this is how you get the extra autumn aces to fill out the set okay you get one through solos and you get the rest through um the the leaves here the fallen leaves now here's a big w huge w cornucopia packs are back now right here you can get on the pack it says you get your uh you get a random 89 plus 50 autumn blast player team of the week legend most feared redux standout heavyweight veteran flashback or rising star player so I think it would be very, 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 very important to maybe live on these filters for a couple of days and see if you can't snipe a couple of these guys. If somebody pulls a card they don't want, they'll be quick to sell it. So keep that in mind. These cost leaves, you get 10 of them, 10 packs, 10 cornucopia packs. Now it's not the same as cornucopias in the past, right? Where we get a whole plethora of them, right? We get one from this program and there, we get like four cards to keep them all. Um, but it's just a random one. But as you can see here, he, he, Kralo pulled an 89 and a 92. So I guess shouts to him and the EA's juiced packs. Um, here's the other one for Autumn All-Stars Fantasy Pack. Now you are able to get these players that you want, right? There's six packs here. There's six Autumn All-Stars. You get one of the six guys um, for free. So you can get any of the other five uh, just by playing solos, getting the leaves or quick selling cards for leaves. Um, and you can power them up to a 93, as we said previously, just by hitting some milestones on that Thanksgiving day with these cards. And there's also Autumn Blast Elite Packs, Autumn Blast Pack. Um, and there's a bundle over there on the far side. Um, that Blast Elite Pack for 60K coins may be interesting. We'll see, we'll dive into that a little bit as you get there. Um, but then here's another look at that fantasy pack. Um, it's gonna be 191 overall autumn all-star player. The players increased to an overall to a max of 93. So keep that in mind. And here are the packs, autumn blast bundles. You got two of them. Um, that five times bundle might be solid, but we don't know yet. So one more thing to note here, we are getting LTDs and the first one's coming Monday and it is gonna be Harrison Smith, 88 speed. Eh. Um, he's a run support, so it might be a solid sub linebacker there. 87 man, 93 zone. He's not the worst in zone. That zone could probably get up to a 99, so that'd be solid. But an 88 speed guy, you know, don't put him in, don't put him out deep in coverage by himself, right? He's gonna get cooked. So that's pretty much it. That's Autumn Blast. That's all they showed us today. Um, there's gonna be more coming Friday. There's gonna be another part of the promo Friday. Just to recap, to go over it before we close everything out here. Um, you are going to get a free 91. You are going to get a free 92. The 91 you get is going to be random. So don't fret. It's going to be random. But the 92 you pick, you make that pick when it's an 80. And then you put the collectibles powered all the way up. And then you got the card. So just keep that in mind there. Um, all four of those 92s go into Romo set. The 91s don't go into a set as of now. Could it have changed Friday? We don't know. I, I would assume not. I'd assume those are just really just exclusive like Thanksgiving players and you keep them if you want. I think a couple we'll go over which ones might be the best options as we get closer, um, which ones you might want to pick over the other ones. But overall, I think it's a W. I think it's a hot W. Um, I think this is going to be a pretty solid promo. We might have some opportunity to make some interesting coins, um, but the, the limits on the packs are, are kind of uh, a buzzkill, I guess you could say. Um, but we'll see. We'll, we'll dive into it. We'll see what we got this week. I mean, tomorrow. Hell, I'll dive in tomorrow and see what we can come out of it with. Maybe we can get a player right away tomorrow as we get through it. All right. Um, so that's it. That's all for me in this video tonight. Appreciate y'all for stopping by as per usual. If you got any questions, hit me up in the comment section below. I'll be happy to answer. Um, but until next time, peace out.